In the vastness of space, celestial bodies dance to the tune of gravity, a tango that occasionally brings them daringly close to Earth. Among these cosmic dancers, there's one that has captured our attention like no other. Its name, Apophis. An asteroid as intriguing as the mythological serpent it's named after, it's been on a collision course with our curiosity since its discovery. In the early 21st century, the world of astronomy was abuzz with whispers of a cosmic intruder. A rocky body from the depths of space. Potentially on a trajectory that might intersect with our home planet. The name of this celestial trespasser, 99942 Apophis. Today we'll unravel the story of Apophis, an asteroid that stirred up a cosmic storm among astronomers worldwide. From its discovery to its composition, its orbital dance with Earth, and the potential risks it poses, we'll delve into it all. So buckle up as we embark on this cosmic journey. Rewind to 2004. A dot of light caught the eyes of astronomers Roy A. Tucker, David J. Tholin, and Fabrizio Bernardi, the birth of Apophis' tale. Nestled within the constellation Aries, a new player was entering the cosmic stage, a celestial entity that would soon grab headlines worldwide. This celestial newcomer was initially christened 2004MN4, a rather uninspiring moniker for what would become a star of the astronomical world. It was not until later that it was fittingly named Apophis after the ancient Egyptian deity symbolizing chaos and chaos is precisely what it brought, albeit figuratively, to the scientific community. You see, initial calculations suggested a shocking possibility. Apophis held a 2.7% chance of striking Earth in 2029. This was a cosmic curveball that shook astronomers to their core. For a brief moment, the world held its breath as scientists scrambled to refine their calculations. The size of Apophis added to the growing concern. With an estimated diameter of about 370 meters, it was not the largest asteroid known to humankind, but it was certainly large enough to cause significant damage. To put it in perspective, the asteroid that wiped out the dinosaurs was approximately 10 kilometers in diameter. But even an asteroid of Apophis's size could unleash devastation akin to thousands of nuclear bombs. As the news spread, Apophis quickly rose from obscurity, becoming a household name. It was an unwelcome reminder of our planet's vulnerability in the grand cosmic ballet, but it was also a wake-up call, a rallying cry for astronomers worldwide to better understand this rogue asteroid and its potential impact on our home planet. This asteroid gave us a serious space scare, but as we'll see, it also sparked a renewed interest in asteroids and the role they play in our universe. So let's continue our journey with Apophis and see what else this cosmic intruder has in store for us. Apophis is more than just a dot in the sky, it's a stony space behemoth, composed of nickel and iron with a bizarre form reminiscent of a rocky peanut. This giant of the cosmos, measuring over a thousand feet long, is almost three and a half football fields in length. Imagine standing at one end of this massive interstellar peanut and looking across its rocky expanse. It's a sight that is as awe-inspiring as it is humbling. But what's even more fascinating about Apophis is its composition. It's a type LL chondrite, meaning it's made up of a mix of metal and silicate minerals. This type of asteroid is fairly common in our solar system, but what sets Apophis apart is its size and its proximity to Earth. Most asteroids of this type are found in the asteroid belt, far from Earth, but not Apophis. It has a habit of coming uncomfortably close to our home planet. The surface of Apophis is also intriguing. It's covered in regolith, a layer of loose, fragmented material that blankets solid bedrock. This regolith is a result of numerous collisions that Apophis has experienced over its long lifetime. Every dent, every crater tells a story of a cosmic collision, a celestial ballet of destruction and creation. The spectral data of Apophis gives us a glimpse into its past. It's a tale told in wavelengths of light, a story of formation, evolution and survival. The spectrum of Apophis tells us that it's a relic of the early solar system, a time when planets were just beginning to form. The data shows us that Apophis has likely been in a continuous state of slow collisional evolution for billions of years. And so, as we delve deeper into the mysteries of Apophis, we find that this celestial peanut is not just a potential threat, but also a window into our cosmic past. The story of Apophis is not just about an asteroid, it's about the history of our solar system, about the forces that shaped it, and about the cosmic dance that continues to this day. Richard Binzel's spectral data gave us a peek 
revealing a past rooted deep in the solar system's own history. To grasp Apophis's true nature, we must compare. The cosmic stage brims with performers, each with their own unique attributes. Some asteroids, like the rocky series, dwarf Apophis, standing as the largest resident of the asteroid belt. Others, like the metallic psyche, offer a stark contrast to Apophis's stony composition. Then there are the comets, icy visitors from the outer reaches of our solar system. They sport a frosty veneer and spectacular tails, a far cry from Apophis's relatively modest appearance. And let's not forget the infamous Chicxulub Impactor, the asteroid that likely triggered the end of the dinosaurs. Its cataclysmic clash with Earth overshadows Apophis's potential for destruction. Yet despite these contrasts, Apophis shares a common thread with these celestial bodies. They are remnants of our solar system's formation, silent witnesses to the cosmic ballet that has been unfolding for billions of years. Each tells a part of the grander narrative of our solar system. While a collision has been ruled out in the near term, the game isn't over. This is the epic tale of Apophis, a celestial body and its gravity tango with our home planet Earth. Predicting the path of an asteroid is a formidable task, akin to predicting the steps of a dancer from across a crowded ballroom. Astronomers must take into account a multitude of factors, from the asteroid's size, shape and composition, to its velocity, spin, and the gravitational influence of other celestial bodies. It's a cosmic puzzle of the highest order, and Apophis is one of its most elusive pieces. When it comes to Apophis, one of the greatest challenges is its close approaches to Earth. Picture this, an asteroid, 370 meters across, hurtling through space at over 28,000 miles per hour, passing within 19,000 miles of our planet. That's closer than some of our own satellites. It's a cosmic dance executed with precision, where one false step could spell catastrophe. Gravity is the driving force in this grand waltz. It's the invisible hand guiding Apophis along its path, a silent conductor orchestrating the rhythm of the cosmos. But gravity is a double-edged sword. While it keeps Apophis in check, it also has the potential to send it hurtling our way. This is known as the Yarkovsky effect, a subtle force caused by the way asteroids absorb sunlight and re-emit that energy as heat. Over time, this can nudge an asteroid off its predicted path, adding another layer of complexity to this celestial ballet. Despite these challenges, astronomers worldwide are tirelessly studying Apophis, refining their models and enhancing our understanding of these cosmic wanderers. It's a testament to human curiosity, a burning desire to unravel the mysteries of the universe, one asteroid at a time. Join me as we explore the intense challenges faced by astronomers in predicting the path of this elusive cosmic vagabond. The story of Apophis is far from over. It's a waltz that continues, a dance where Earth and asteroids spin in a gravity tango, each awaiting their next move in this cosmic ballet. From its inception to its near pass in 2029, Apophis's story is a testament to human curiosity and our relentless pursuit to understand the universe. This space-roaming rock, which once existed as an obscure celestial body, has etched its name into the annals of astronomy, stirring up a cosmic storm among stargazers worldwide. First spotted by the discerning eyes of astronomers Roy A. Tucker, David J. Tholin, and Fabrizio Bernardi in 2004, Apophis quickly rose to fame, not for its glamour, but for its potential threat. Named after an ancient Egyptian symbol of chaos, this asteroid indeed played its part well, causing considerable consternation among the space enthusiasts. But Apophis is more than just a harbinger of potential chaos. It's a stony behemoth, a cosmic wanderer composed of nickel and iron, with a form reminiscent of a rocky peanut. Thanks to Richard Binzel's spectral data, we've managed to catch a glimpse beneath its surface, revealing a past rooted deep in the solar system's own history. When we put Apophis side by side with its asteroid kin, we see a part of the larger narrative of our solar system. Ordinary chondrites, icy comets, and even the ill-fated dinosaur destroyer. Each tells a unique tale, yet they all share common threads that weave the fabric of our cosmic neighborhood. Yet, the dance of Apophis with Earth continues, a delicate tango choreographed by the force of gravity. While a collision has been ruled out in the near term, the challenges faced by astronomers in predicting the path of this cosmic vagabond remain intense. Apophis's tale is a reminder of the delicate balance that exists in our universe, a balance that swings between chaos and calm, between the known and the unknown. 
It is a reminder of our place in the cosmos, of our vulnerability and our resilience. But as this asteroid sails safely by, we breathe a collective sigh of relief. We've danced with chaos and emerged unscathed, ready to continue our journey of exploration, to unravel the countless stories the cosmos has yet to tell.